afternoon from the CBS 19 newsroom. I'm Jillian Sheridan. And I'm Justin Early. Police have arrested one of two suspects in connection with the attempted robbery at the CVS pharmacy last Thursday. 35-year-old Keithan Williams is suspected of being the getaway driver during that attempted robbery at the pharmacy on South Broadway. Police are still trying to find the other suspect who went into the store wearing a skull mask armed with a handgun. Tonight we're showing you how to shop safely after a 60-year-old woman almost lost her purse to a thief. Happened in the parking lot of Walmart on Highway 64 last night. She was injured in the attack. Tyler police say the thief grabbed her purse and then pushed her to the ground, but she held on. What the victim has to say tonight. A Nacogdoches woman is now in jail after police say she lied about being kidnapped. Nacogdoches police arrested 23-year-old Melrina Jessica Stemmen yesterday for giving a false report to a peace officer. After investigating for about a week, detectives determined the report was made up. Judge Joel Baker will hold a news conference tomorrow to announce his plans whether to seek re-election as Smith County judge in 2014. Certified public accountant John Furlow recently announced he is running for the Smith County judge position. Judge Baker took office in 2007. This year marks the 80th anniversary of the outdoor movie theater. In tonight's Emmy Award winning J.B.'s Journal, J.B. Smith shows us the history of drive-in theaters right here in East Texas. All that plus weather and sports tonight on KYTX CBS 19 News at 5 and 6. You can get the latest anytime online at CBS19.tv.